Hey everyone, my name is Michelle Fallon and I am the Artistic Director of the Washington Performing Arts Children of the Gospel Choir. We have been around since 1993 here in the DMV and we have seen hundreds of students come through our program. That in itself is an honor and a privilege to be able to direct a group of nine to 18 year olds who are extremely talented and gifted and they love music. But the true blessing is that we are able to teach them and nurture their gifts and their talents through the medium of gospel music. They're learning about a beautiful art form that so many of us, we feel in the midst of our souls, we're encouraged, we're inspired, and it brings us hope. And I'm hoping that uh, through what we do here at Washington Performing Arts within COTG. It is lifelong. It makes an impression on them, not only musically, but in their character as human beings. Today, I have the great privilege of talking about two people. One, Reginald Van Lee, who is our former board chairperson and the award that we are giving in honor of him, called the Reggie, appropriately named, to a wonderful student named Madison Littlejohn. We created this scholarship a couple of years ago because we wanted to honor the fact that we have students who represented themselves like Reggie did in the formative years, were heavily involved in the arts. Reggie was a dancer. And uh, as quiet as it's kept, he also can hum a wonderful tune. And um, But Reggie is in the business sector. And we have students who come to us who just love music, but they're also gifted in the science and math and English and just all facets of life. Maybe they want to incorporate music into the sciences or the maths, or they just want to use it as a pastime. But they really... Um, have been committed to growing their gifts and growing their talents while they were here. And so we wanted students, we wanted to choose a student who would represent what Reggie represents in the business sector, but has a love and passion where the arts has never left him. And he has been such a proponent and a great supporter of all we do. Madison Littlejohn, for me, has been that student this year to receive the award. I've watched her over the years and there has been such an enlightening change that has taken over her. At one time she was very quiet and always busy drawing. I always noticed that she was into something else and one day she showed me this beautiful portfolio filled with images and I was really quite astonished that she had this talent, and from that point, I wanted to figure out how we, as an organization, could also nurture the gifts that the other gifts that these students had that weren't just for singing. So, Madison was on the team that actually drew pictures for one of our concerts called Stay Woke, Still Woke, which was completely student created and run with a tad bit of guidance. So the students have to follow a very particular criteria. They have to have a good GPA in school. They have to be a current member of COTG. And then they have to write um, an essay about why they think that they should receive this and uh, how Madison decided to be so creative and to share with us a piece of herself was uh, what I thought just took it over the top for me. And she really exemplifies one who does not want to be a singer, but she wants to use the other gifts that she has into her life as a career, as her passion, as her purpose to follow through. And that exemplified for me what we have as the Reggie Award. Hello, my name is Madison Littlejohn. I'm 18 years old and I've been with Children of the Gospel for about five years now. 
Um, my favorite memories regarding COTG is definitely when we do our showstopper songs, as I like to call them. Those are the songs that make people like really get up and uh, either clap with us or raise their hands or sing with us or whatever. And just those like moments immediately after the last note when we cut off and everybody just has their standing ovations and like the energy among everybody is just palpable and it is super amazing. Like I can always feel myself having to catch my breath because it's just so powerful and I always love those moments. Like I look forward to those moments after every song and uh, it always makes me happy when we can achieve that because I know that we touch some people. So that's definitely one of my favorite memories of COTG. As for how it's impacted me, I believe that it's brought my love of singing to uh, another level because before I liked singing a lot. I was always in my choirs in school, but joining COTG made me appreciate it and love it even more and realize how much actual hard work it is to sing. How like, it's not compli it's not super duper complicated, but it's a art. Like when you say musical artist, you mean it's an art because there's a lot of things that go into making music and singing and vocal care. I had no idea how much went into vocal care until I saw, well, until I got into COTG. It was an experience learning that. Being the winner of the Reggie Award showed me that my work that I put into the choir hasn't gone unnoticed and the work that I've done when it comes to schooling hasn't gone, hasn't gone unnoticed. And knowing that makes me want to work even harder and do even better as I continue on with my higher education. Now, as for what this does for me, I mentioned in my submission video that I wanted to go to school completely debt-free. I didn't want to take out any student loans. I don't want to do any of that. And having this scholarship definitely will help cover some of the costs that are involved and will help me take that next step and it will help me in my career definitely because the colleges that I wish to go to are um, colleges that revolve around visual arts which is something that I am really passionate about and I want to um, invest in it. Now to everybody else in the choir my message to you is keep on pushing, keep on striving. You're all amazing. You're all so talented, like amazingly, amazingly talented. And I know that you will all get far in life and I'll never forget any of you guys. I love you all. Hi, I'm Reggie Van Lee, former chairman of the board of Washington Performing Arts and a current board member. I've been a board member for 13 years. First introduced to Washington Performing Arts actually through Doug Wheeler, but fell in love with it through seeing the Children of the Gospel at their first uh, summer, well not the first, rather their summer recital. It was amazing and it caused me to love WPA forever. I continue to support Washington Performing Arts and in particular the Children of the Gospel Choir because I know personally the transformative powers of the arts and the transformative powers of gospel music to kids and to adults. Children of the Gospel is significant to me because, believe it or not, I was not only a member of my church choir, gospel choir as a kid, and directed that choir as a kid, but at MIT I was also the director of the gospel choir. So this notion of gospel music and children has been important to me forever. When I discovered Washington Performing Arts, Children of the Gospel, I fell in love. The Reggie Award means everything to me. I've never had anything named after me in that way, and for it to be about children, about gospel music, and about the performing arts, it couldn't be more special for me. Uh, and to lend my name, uh, there's nothing I want more to lend my name to than this fantastic award. And the student that is winning the award this year, Madison, 
Uh, I was so impressed not only with your application, uh, with the recommendations from people uh, that recommended you, but when they talked about your spirit and your energy and all the things that you do with uh, confidence and with uh, happiness, it felt like me. It felt like the me that I like to project. So this is very much in line with who I am. And for you to get this award, it's an honor to me. So congratulations, Madison. And thank you for doing what you do, being who you are, and taking on an award under my name. Thank you and congratulations. We're thrilled to recognize Madison's passion, excellence, work ethic, and achievement with the Reggie Award. We're excited about her future and so impressed by all of the qualities she brought to the choir and further developed as a member. She joins a group of very vibrant and distinguished alumni. On behalf of the award committee, the gospel programs committee of the board of directors, and the many contributors who lent their support to the creation of this award in honor of our treasured and deeply admired former chair, Reggie Van Lee, I congratulate Madison, wish her all the best, and thank her truly for the example she has set and for her strong presence and voice. I am absolutely thrilled that we are able this year to present to Madison Littlejohn the Reggie Award because it's so well deserved. And I am grateful to stand here to be the director of Madison Littlejohn and all of the other members that I call my lambs in the Washington Performing Arts Children of the Gospel. Thank you. God bless.